Hello everyone, this is Ravdius Blog and welcome to the Movie News Roundup series. So we got a bit of movie news this week, but before we get into that, here are a few words from the channel. Alright everybody, it's time to get on the social media train. Want to chat with me in 100 words or less? Then check out my Twitter account. Want to talk about movies, TV shows, and video games within the group? Then check out my Facebook account. Want to check out some of my ultra cool fan art? Then check out my DeviantArt page. Want to get the lowdown on everything that's happening on this channel? Then check all of the above. And now, we return to our regularly scheduled program. So this week's movie news is that the 2022 film Batgirl has been canceled by Warner Brothers. And as stated in this article, the movie starring Leslie Grace as the crime fighter was abruptly shelved this week despite being in the midst of post-production, leading to an uproar online as fans fear they might never see the nearly finished movie. On Ernie's call Thursday, Warner Brothers Discovery CEO David Zasloff was unapologetic about the decision. Our objective is to grow the DC brand, to grow the DC characters, but also our job is to protect the DC brand, he said. This was in response to a question about why the Batgirl movie was killed so late in the process. Unnamed sources have said in some media reports that studio executives were not happy with the direction of the film and were unwilling to invest more to fix it, choosing instead to take a tax write-off by abandoning it. And there's a bit more to this article from Vanity Fair about what DC is going to do for their future movies. So we're going to go ahead and read up that article, which states, We think that we could build a long-term, much stronger, sustainable growth business out of DC, Zasloff said. As part of that, we're going to focus on quality. We're not going to release any film before it's ready. We're not going to release a film just to make a financial quarter. The focus is going to be how do we make each of these films in general as good as possible. But DC is something that we think we can make better. Now it's time for Thoughts for the Day where I talk about my opinions about this week's movie news. So one of my thoughts about Batgirl getting cancelled. Honestly, I'm really upset about this. Like, I was hoping that we would get a Batman film that doesn't just star Batman and actually features the characters from Batman's world like Batgirl and Nightwing. And I was really looking forward to seeing the Batgirl movie. Because we never really seen a movie that was made about Batgirl. Like I felt like Batgirl is one of those characters from the comics that doesn't get a lot of attention. Unless you're a huge comic book fan. And when I heard that Warner Bros. was going to be making a Batgirl movie. I was actually pretty excited about this because that means that we get a chance to see Batgirl on the big screen. Now I wasn't sure about which Batgirl they were going to use. Were they going to use Stephanie Brown or were they going to use Barbara Gordon? I wasn't 100% sure. But yeah, the fact that we're not getting a Batgirl movie and therefore we're not going to get more focus on the other characters in the Batman world is very disappointing to me because I was hoping that we get some more focus on characters like Nightwing and especially Batgirl in the DCEU. And now that the Batgirl movie is being canceled, we probably might not have a chance to see that. But here's the other half of the news that I was interested in. I do like the fact that Warner Bros. is trying to focus on making their movies good instead of just putting out a random movie in theaters. Because even though the last few DC movies that started with Wonder Woman were pretty good, I still think that the DC movies could be a bit better. And I think that the fact that they're going to try to focus more on making these films high quality instead of just pushing them out is a pretty good move on their part. Like I want to see these movies be even better in quality in terms of the storytelling and in terms of character development. Now as far as are these movies going to be connected to each other, I'm not 100% sure yet. But yeah, the fact that we'll be getting more high quality movies in the near future is a bit exciting to me. But at the same time, I am a bit upset about the Batgirl news too. But overall, regarding this week's movie news, I am very disappointed that we're not getting a Batgirl movie because I was really hoping that we would see Batgirl on the big screen at some point. But on the other hand, I do like the fact that Warner Bros. is trying to focus on bringing out more better quality films in the near future. And I am a bit excited to see what other films are going to bring out in the near future. So that's my thoughts on this week's movie news and tell me in the comments down below. Are you upset that Batgirl is being cancelled? And do you hope that the future DC movies are of better quality? Please let me know in the comments down below. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is Robbie's vlog and I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, like this video? 
If you want to check out more crazy content from this channel, then please hit that big old colorful subscribe button. And if you are feeling extra generous, then please support me through Patreon so I can make more awesome content for this channel.